meaning that it will be soon in South Africa, in Guatemala. And then we have to face the virus ourselves. So in this case, knowledge is power. So we, we're preparing you to actually understand what is going on. Now these are the countries that are affected by the virus, China, Thailand, Japan, Republic of, of Korea, Hong Kong, Taiwan, Singapore, Malaysia, Iran, Italy, South Korea, Brazil. These are the countries that are affected by the virus. Now, firstly, let's explain what is a virus. It's a submicroscopic organism which can cause disease. Cool, eh? The one we are um, addressing you on is coronaviruses. It's a family of viruses that causes illness ranging from common cold to more severe uh, diseases such as the one I'm going to list here, Middle East Respiratory Syndrome, Acute Respiratory Syndrome, and then there is a new strain that has not been previously identified in human, which is a novel coronavirus. Detailed investigation find that severe acute re respiratory uh, syndrome was transmitted from the civet cats to human. So it comes from animals to human. Common sign are the following. How do we know we're having a problem? Once you start having difficulty in breathing, you know you have symptoms of the virus. Respiratory systems, all your breathing system will be affected. You start sweating in a form of fever and coughing. You know you have problems. Shortness of breath and breathing difficulties. Those are signs that you, you need special attention. In more severe causes, infection can cause pneumonia, acute respiratory syndrome when you cannot breathe properly, kidney failure, and even death. Standard recommendation to prevent the infection include regular hand washing, covering your mouth and nose when you're, when you're coughing and sneezing, thorough cooking of meat and eggs, avoid close contact with anyone showing symptoms of the res uh, respiratory illness, such as coughing and sneezing. All right, I've, I've mentioned in this number of things, common system, uh, symptoms, it's fever, when you sweat and shaking, tiredness, unnecessary tiredness, dry cough, headache, muscle pain, nasal congestion, now I'm a finger in German name. All right, uh, runny, runny nose, severe throat or sore throat, diarrhea. People who are, might be affected by this thing quickly are older people with medical problems. Ne? Uh, where you find Ukraine is having high blood pressure, diabetes, those are people we must take care of quickly so that we, we, we get to the nearest clinic. Now, things that we need to consider as and when you discover that uh, some of these symptoms are unavoidable is washing your hands regularly. I'm just emphasizing important things, but use soap. Don't just wash your hands, use soap. Cover your mouth your nose, 
when you are coughing. You'll see on TV, many of the Chinese people are covering their mouth. That's, that's a way of dealing with the virus. Avoid touching your eyes, your nose, your mouth. Okay. For now, I got to be corner. All right. Mina Nyakuz. So let's do it again. Avoid touching your eyes, nose, and mouth. Do not get too close to people who are coughing, sneezing, or exhaling. So you must keep one meter from the person next to you. So I'm, I'm relating this message because at one stage, can you see how, how many of us are here at assembly? Yes. And if we had to stand one meter from each other, it means it can quickly spread to all of us in just one taking. Tomorrow, the entire school can be affected or infected by the virus, and then we no more have schools. I think in, in Iran, I think it's Iran or Kuwait, schools are closed for a duration of time which will be determined as and when assessment indicate it has sat down. So this information is intended for you, but also to your families and communities. Okay. And, and I want us to take care of ourselves, understand that there is a virus going globally, and there are people who have died from it. In China, I'm told the number is above 3,000. Outside China, is almost 2,700. So a virus is airborne. It doesn't respect borders, political affiliation, whether you are poor or rich, it will come where you are. All we can do is to know about it and how to behave once we realize it's in our midst. Sezwana Wandran. Thank you.